Let's see how this guy goes together. Seems simple enough. There we go. Then you extend it by loosening. There we go, there's one. There's another one. Tighten them up here so that they don't collapse again. And it looks like we're good to go. This is a nice little mop dust mop. Yeah, just move that all the way around there. Nice dust mop. My floor wasn't very dirty, so I don't expect it to have picked up much. <laughs> but this is the kind of a mop head that I really like. The nice thing about this is taking it off. You simply press here. and it breaks down and your mop head comes off. Alternately, you can put on just any sort of a towel, plug it into the little uh, holes there and you have another dust mop. To put in the broom portion, of course this part comes off Don't drop it like I did, okay? This is the rubber broom, which I thought is pretty interesting. I've never used one like it. It has a squeegee. We're gonna find out how it works. Again, simply screw it onto the handle. And there you go. It works as a broom. Flip it over, you've got a squeegee. I'm not going to make you sit here and wait while I go check out my windows and floors using this, but I'll put it in my comments. All in all, so far, I haven't officially used it yet, but I really like this. It's supposed to catch dust, uh, dog hair, cat hair, pet hair. Also should do windows. We'll find out. I'll let you know in my comments.